Answers! One, two, three. Answers! The last time Waterford lost a softball game was in May of 2009, a 2-0 loss to Fitch. Falcons! Wednesday's meeting between the Lancers and the Falcons featured a matchup between two of the state's top players. Fitch senior shortstop Brianna Turgeon was last year's Connecticut Gatorade Player of the Year. I am just well aware of her strength and her talent. While Waterford junior pitcher Kelly Connors has led the Lancers to 46 straight wins. Kelly's a great pitcher. And they're more than just ECC rivals. She and Kelly play in the same summer team together. They're good friends. And, you know, that's, I think that was uh, the ultimate challenge for Kelly. She knows how good Brie is. She knows, she, and she even said at practice, she's so good. During last season's meeting, Turgeon had two hits off of Connors. But during Wednesday's game, a 7-0 Waterford win, the pitcher came out on top, getting a fly out in the first inning and a ground out in the third. We know how good she is, and I think that little bit of knowledge that Kelly has on the inside, just having played with her, um, helped her here. She definitely picked on me with getting hit my weak spots today. She did a great job of that. Kept the ball low, her change-ups. She did a good job all around. In the fifth, Turzon came up with two on and one out, trailing four to nothing. Connors shook off her catcher, throwing a changeup for a called first strike. I think I know what she can do better because I like study that and like before the game I look at what she can hit, what she missed, what she didn't swing at and stuff. So I was well aware of the, like what I wanted to throw to her. Um, everybody else I usually don't shake off many pitches, but for her I was you know, well aware of what I wanted to do. They worked her. They watched it closely and we talked about it, what we needed to do, and they watched her swing and, you know, if that change-up that she throws is either a few miles per hour faster or slower, <laughs> she crushes it, you know? So it was just the right speed, just the right location. I mean, because Brie is just that good that you can't make a mistake with her. And, and I think Kelly knew there was little room for error. And fortunately, she pitched it at the right speed and the right location. The final pitch of the at-bat was another change-up. It's so awesome for the sport. It is so awesome for these girls to have that experience and, you know, play against the best and rise to the occasion. It's so exciting for them, not only in their softball life, but I think it's so exciting for them in, in their regular life because those moments, those either do it or don't do it, are, are moments that they're going to have in their life outside of sports. And, um, you know, if they carry that same intensity into that, those moments outside of sports, they're just going to be successful women. And, um, you know, I think the more moments they have like that, the, the stronger and more confident they're going to be, and who knows where they can go.